Education is a future business. You look at the skills and talents they need for that future. Society in general didn't invent ICT on a whim. They did it in order to do real things. And it's those real things that we need to do. Mugseaton is England's first trust school. It brings together Microsoft, tribal education, the local education authority, and higher education into a partnership that delivers new ways of learning using the best models for improving. This is a pyramid. This is where all the ICT goes on, although there are 10 dedicated computer suites. There are three in here. Um, there are specialist ones for ICT and for languages. At the minute we've got history going on, we've got sport going on, a bit of science. I think it's fair to say that ICT is not an option anymore. All students need ICT, they need to use it. We're very much involved in using ICT across the curriculum. All of our staff are, are very well trained and very well equipped to deliver lots of interesting learning experiences using ICT. All design um, courses require some aspect of CAD, uh, so it's very important that the students get a grip to it at an early age. They can download the software, take it home, and they can practice on it, so when they come to do their GCSEs, they're proficient on it. And it's a little bit of fun as well. We're going to do a live session one note, sharing session, right? You've done this before, but what we want you to do today, we want you to work in pairs. So I'm going to let them, the software choose the pairs for you. I think the ICT facilities that we have at Monkseaton are invaluable to the students. What we teach them to do is upload their documents onto SharePoint itself and then they can access these from home, from the actual school, so that's it. then they can't say they've lost the homework. So what the students are doing presently is creating websites. They're then going to post their website up on this live OneNote session and evaluate each other's work and it's like an MSN for them. If they can see what each other are typing and they absolutely love it. And so they don't really realise that they're learning. You don't need to be sitting in the same seat because you're using a live session. When you're teaching them they sometimes teach you as well, you know. You've got to just keep that one step ahead of them which is quite difficult these days. I take A-level ICT and I, um, I've been, had to work with a business so I chose to work at my dad's restaurant and uh, I created a website. He's going to use that eventually, hopefully. When I've never really made a website before, I used like video tutorials on the internet and you know, worked through those with my teacher. I just learned how to do all the editing and you know, changing all the features and that, and then just kind of, you know, you learn as you go, really. We want ICT facilities to be available to all, in all subjects. So the new school is very much like this, that classrooms are there, and just outside the classrooms there will be the ICT. But we're not throwing the ICT into the classroom, it's there for when it wants to be used. The building behind me is built in just a year and it uses a tremendous setup in terms of organization. And we've copied from that in what we're doing in teaching and learning. IT will facilitate the 20% of learning that's independent learning. We'll have students in the sixth form who are entirely independent learning through the Open University. They'll have an opportunity to work in a way that people do in modern society. I would like to see every, all the teachers use IT in the school and I think the new build is going to do this because there are such huge facilities. I'm really excited about working in the new building and the students just think it's great. It encourages them. In the community there's a focus on IT. We already run a family learning programme and we support every school in North Tyneside with primary languages and all the materials they need for every lesson. Microsoft are helping us establish a Microsoft Academy that will allow businesses and local people to upskill from no knowledge of IT at all to being professionally qualified experts. Everyone is a partner in making the school of the future a reality through ICT. Mm -hmm.